times you put your foot in it, and I said if Tulane's got as much chance of beating LSU straight up, the, as the Russians would have a beating in Kenna Sunday. So naturally, I've had dozens and dozens of phone calls. In fact, Ernie Buston from Oncadia Street in Kenna has given me this hat. He said, you better wear it in case you find some Russians in Kenna. Coach, congratulations. Thank you, buddy. It was a great, great win for Tulane, and I'm so proud of our football team and coaches. They've gone through a lot of adversity, and it was a great way for them to end the season and show that they could come back. And uh, i tell you one thing. That senior class has had a hard time this year, and they never had a losing season, and they get to go out beating LSU three of the four years they're there. They were playing, and that's something they can remember a lifetime. And I'm so happy for Tulane fans because I know how they care about Tulane and how they've hurt this year, and it gives them something to hold their heads up. And our young people coming back will have something to look forward to next year. Coach, what did you accomplish and your coaching staff that Bobby Bowden and his fine Florida State team couldn't accomplish? Well, buddy, I think the thing that we had going for us is our kids uh, believe they could beat LSU. Winning last year helped us. And we could show last year's film where our guys played against that great defense that they've got and, and saw themselves playing well. And the big thing also, we didn't make those turnovers we've been plagued with all year. We had 33 turnovers uh, going into this ball game. We only had one. And that was a big uh, effect on the ball game because we were able to move the football. Mike McKay had a great game. And our offensive line played well last week against Florida. They uh, played again well again this year, this week against the excellent defensive football team. And Mike McKay just really picked them well. And I, I want to really congratulate Ken Meyer and the offensive staff. Ken, uh, I know, has taken some heat this year because we've made a lot of mistakes offensively. But what a great job he did of, uh, with the offensive game plan and calling plays. He did a fantastic job. And our defense uh, held an excellent uh, LSU football team to 28 points. That sounds silly, but they've got a fine, fine offensive football team. And, and what a great game J James had. Wasn't he fantastic? And I tell you what, LSU's got a great football team, buddy. I mean, they're better than I even anticipated they would be. They've really done a great coaching job. And uh, I want to really congratulate them on going to the Orange Bowl. And I know me, for one, I, for one, I'm going to be pulling for them 500% against Nebraska because I think they've done a fantastic job. Okay, we have a real special treat for you today. What the treat is, a highlight feature, which is going to take you into the locker room before the game, onto the two-lane bench during the game, into the locker room at halftime, and then into the victory celebration afterwards. But first, we're going to have the highlights right after this timeout. <laughs> An important message from Burger King. For a long time, there's been McDonald's, Burger King, and Wendy's. Some things change, some don't. But the Whopper beat the Big Mac for best taste overall among consumers of both burgers. In a similar test, we beat Wendy's single. Sorry, guys. As a result, there will still be McDonald's, Burger King, and Wendy's, but not necessarily in that order. Aren't you hungry for Burger King now? They're going to make this touchdown, Frank. How about a bet, huh? John, I'm no gambler. Look, I drive a McElwain. What a week. My car's out. And that service department, your problem's simple. Just get a McElwain. Fancy crowd pulling in today. No kidding, this is my fourth McElwain. McElwain, the New Orleans name for Cadillac. For personal or business growth, financial counsel is vital. Hibernia's international expertise helps us expand our business worldwide. Hibernia's investment counseling works for me and my company as well. Hibernia's cash management program helps us earn the maximum on our corporate funds. Hibernia Bank has been serving successful people and their businesses for years and doing it in a way they have come to expect and appreciate. Hibernia National Bank, member FDIC. Deep in Devon, England, is Gidley Park, the inn given the award for the best wine cellar in Great Britain. Its owner is an American, the wine authority Paul Henderson. Recently, he compared two California Chablis. I compared Taylor California Cellars and Almaden Mountain Chablis, and the difference is striking. Taylor California Cellars is far better tasting. It has a crisper taste, a cleaner taste, a fresher taste. There's no question which wine I would recommend. Taylor California Cellars, a better Chablis. Judge for yourself. 
Let's roll the tape now and get Coach Gibson's reaction to Tulane's stunning 31-28 upset of LSU. Tony Wood kicks off out of the end zone on first and 10 of the 20. The highlights start off and Lester Lavalet chops Hilliard for no gain and it's second down and 10. Lester played a fine ball game. Second down and 10, Richard back to pass, throws the screen and he overthrows Hilliard again. Third down, and we were always very concerned about Richard scrambling with the ball, and he goes back to pass, the thing, quarterback draw, and he makes eight yards. Fine football uh, player Richard is. We get the ball on our first series, and there's Reginelli going for seven yards. Our offensive line really came off the ball. Look at that fine run by Kelvin Robinson. He gains one, but he had to really move well. His McKay came back to pass. He hit Bill for nine yards in the first down. Watch Bill in these highlights. He really runs hard. Look at this run by Kelvin Wright. It's just a great run. 22 yards in the first down. This is our first series. It's Reginelli catching the ball. First down, 12 yards. What a fantastic game he played. It's Kelvin Robinson up the middle for five. Look at the hole. Look at this touchdown run by Reginelli. Look at him. Boy, oh, what a great game he played. I'm just so proud of him. Look at the guys excited. We got on the board first, and it was 7-0. And they come back and tied it 7-7. And, and they come running up the middle, miles for one yard. Here's Richard throwing incomplete, but the score is 7-7. They about to score again. Here's a big play right here. It's James out in the flat. It's Tipton and Lionel Washington coming over to make a tackle. Fourth down and one. Richard throws. To James again, and Lionel Washington over and knocks it back, and that was a big stop for us. Woo, we needed that. Now, McKay back to throw, and he hits Griffin for 18 yards. What a catch right there. Wasn't that a beautiful catch? First down. He's billed for five. Look at this effort he made. Look at him run up in there. He's billed for six. Look at him, fighting and scrapping. Baton Rouge, that'd be a great thrill for him. But watch this play by Butts for 12 yards. Turns it right up in there. Fine run by Reggie. What a great career he's had. And McKay back to pass. Griffin for five yards. Here's Reginelli right here. For one, LSU's got a fine defensive football team. K to Butts for six. And these are one of these automatics that we had just uh, put in versus their blitzes. Here's Reginelli for three. Now watch this play right here. K back to throw. Hits Wayne Smith right down the middle for 17 yards. A great call by Ken Meyer. Look at the kicks him. That's a real tough battle. Watch this throw to J. Rose. K to J. Rhodes touchdown, a freshman from Baton Rouge. What a thrill that is for him. Now here we got the ball again. It's Reginelli for four yards. Look at old Frank Roberts knock him off the ball. It's Bills for three. This is the third quarter with a score tied, 14-14. Big possession. We kept that ball eight minutes in the drive right there. Bill gets three. It builds for four. Look at this effort by Elton. Wasn't it fantastic? Look at this play by Reginelli right there. Ten yards, first down. We kept the ball, as I said, eight minutes. Did McKay on another little quick pass right there to Griffin for five. Watch this play to Butts. Look at the got big rush on him, and Butts catches it. Look at this effort by Reggie. Twelve-yard gain. Great play by Reggie Butt. First down. Came back to pass. Goes out to Elton for first down. This is another big first down. Look at that effort right there. Fantastic effort. We got the ball again. We came back to pass. Watch him dump it right off the sofa, right over the middle. A little delay. Look at the poise Mike had. Stover caught two or three big passes in the traffic court. It's Kelvin for five yards right here. Good block by... T-Bird Rose right there. Here's a real good play right here. Bill's getting seven yards right here. Look at this blocking. Good block. Look at this run by Elf. Fine Elf. Watch this great catch right here. McKay back to throw. Throws it up. Watch this catch. 
catch by Wayne Smith. He makes a great catch every year against these guys. Same type of catches he made last year. Big play, puts us ahead 21-14. There's Earl Jenkins making a big play for four yards against Hilliard. It's Martin on a reverse pass. LeBray comes through there and pulls the ball loose for a minus one. So we get the ball back. Score's tied 21-21. There's Reginelli bumping up in there for four. The fourth quarter. There's another quick pass to Griffin for 10 yards. Look at this effort by Roberts. Look at it. He won't go down. 10 yards. Score 21-21. There's Reginelli for six. Gives another excellent, excellent blocking. Now watch this play right here. McKay back to pass. Watch this play right here. Big play. McKay throws. Watch this catch by Griffin. Fantastic catch for 18 yards and a big first down. Here's Tony Wood. Ends up to be the winning play of the ball game. A 42-yard field goal. Great field goal. Great pressure kick. And we go ahead 24-21. But they come back and go ahead 28-24. And Bill's getting six yards with behind. There's another six-yard pass to Griffin. Watch this play right here. Katie Smith. 16 yards. Big catch in the ball game. Fourth quarter. We got to score to win. Katie Griffin. 17 yards. What another great catch by Robert Griffin. Is McKay back to throw? Sits under pressure. Catches the butt for six yards. At fourth down, now watch this play right here. K backs off, dumps it off to Reginelli. They had the blitz on there. Reginelli running down the sideline. Stays in bounds and touchdown. What a great way to end out Reggie's career. He'll remember that touchdown the rest of his life. Boy, am I proud of this football team. Now, here's the last of the ball game right there. They're threatening. As David Jackson coming through, he and Lester uh, Lavalet trap him right there for losing five yards. Push it back to pass. Hits James. Boom! Earl Jenkins comes over there and traps him for a one-yard gain. There's 33 seconds to go. Push it back to pass. Goes deep to Martin in the end zone. Tyrone Smith jumps up. Interception. His first one of the year. What a great way to end his career. That's Donald Ray Thomas. That's Earl Jenkins. Look at those kids excited. Boy, with all the adversity they've had, what a great way to end up their season. There's David Jackson. Man, am I proud of him. Here it is a replay. Richard back to pass. A great quarterback, a great competitor. Throws deep to a great receiver, Martin. And there's Tyrone Smith back there. He goes up in the air, and he'll always remember that interception. Now, in a moment, we're going to show you all of the excitement of the sidelines, the locker room, and everything. A real special look at it. But, Coach, right now, uh, gosh, I don't know, uh, this this victory tonight uh, not only solidifies you, takes the heat off a of Hyman wall, but it has to help your program, recruiting-wise, everything-wise. Well, we really needed that win, and Hyman Wall is a super individual. You know, he's gone through a lot of heat, and it hurt me because I know how he's worked so hard to build his program up and done such a fantastic job as, we, as Dr. Kelly is, and it really hurts me that they get on him. People have gotten on him, and it's bothered me a lot, and I hope that people realize that the great job that he's done, and uh, this win, I think, will help some of the people feel better about our program. If it, if it doesn't, something's wrong with them, because that was a great win for our program, and it's got to help us, because it's going to motivate our people. We don't lose hardly any people. We lose some good seniors, but we've got a lot of people coming back, and we should be a much improved football team next year. So it, this win was a great win for our program, and one we really needed, buddy. Okay, Coach, we'll be back with that special look right after this timeout. Double your savings now at Royal O's with closeout prices, plus the amazing 10.9% APR financing on the full line of over 100 new 82 Oldsmobiles, including the fabulous Cutlass and a number of demonstrators. Not only will you save on price, but you'll save an additional $1,200 to $1,700 with 10.9% as compared to 16 to 18% APR financing. Hurry at Royal O's for the bargain of your life. Today, there is a company in Louisiana that sets the pace for every other company in its field. 
a company over one million Louisianians and thousands of businesses look to when they need help. A forward-moving company with health care plans that protect people from the worst by giving the best. This is Blue Cross of Louisiana, the leader in health care protection for over 50 years. Blue Cross. You can depend on it. Eastern, America's favorite way to fly, now flies to South America. So if you want to get the most out of South America, go with the U.S. airline that flies to the most cities in South America. Call your travel agent for Eastern Airlines. We're making it happen. We're working for you at NBC and Jefferson. We're making it happen for you. I'm a New Orleans steel and aluminum wholesaler. And when I needed money to buy land and build a new warehouse, I went to NBC Jeff. And I got $1,200,000. At NBC and Jefferson, we're making it happen for you. Member FDIC. Give you an inside look. Coach Gibson allowed our cameramen from Channel 6, Dominic Martin and Darnell Cunningham, free run of the locker room before the game, at halftime, after the game, and free run of the Tulane sideline to Tulane bench. And the able editing of J.B. Ratto, well, this is the piece from start to finish. You waited all the time. You hear them out there laughing at you. You hear them out there laughing at you, running the score up, talking about what they're going to do to you. Get excited. Hell, let's have some fun. We got all the game, nothing to lose, right? Yeah. All the game, nothing to lose. Uh, yeah. now, what does it mean to you? What does it mean to you? It means everything to us. We worked hard. Everything to us. Get our respect back. <laughs> If your asses are quit going and doing exactly what we told you not to do, and tackling low, and bunny him up high, linebackers not overrun, you stop the sweep, we're going to win. If we don't let Martin line out, Thomas, Bruce Roy, they're going to try to get the ball to him. We don't be conscious of tra trading him. Don't let him be the deep. Knock his tail off when he comes around you. Tyrone, be alert for him coming across it on the slant. We'll beat him. Right there, those are the two things. Stop Martin. And stop that strong sweep. Other than that, we gotta have a better pass rush. Offense. We moving that ball super. We got their number. We they can't stop. We got them off balance. Our offensive line, take it to them. If they got a running game going, yeah, mix it up. Yeah, they cannot yeah. stop a passing game now. Oh, Guys, you're 30 minutes away from something that you can remember, seniors. Everybody gets to the side.
Everybody take it on the knee. Everybody take it on the knee. Take it on the knee. Beating two LSU three out of your four years. And that's something you can live with the rest of your life. And I'll tell you what, fellas. I'm going to tell you something. Two years in a row. Hey, come on. I'm going to tell you something, fellas. I've never been more proud of a football team than I am of you. I just want you to know how proud I am of you. Now, let me. That's a great, great effort. Everybody on the way, you did a super job. Let's bow our heads. And fellas, hey, one big important thing. Let's show class. That's a hell of a football team we beat. A hell of a football team. A hell of a football team. And we're a good football team, too. You